Who is this Mickey Truth girl? Who qualifies her to put a work on these people? What's up, what's up, y'all? It's your girl, Mickey Truth, aka the Queen of Paperwork, and I am back with another video. As always, all information contained in this video is for entertainment educational purposes only. All information used in this video is per the Fair Use Act. And any conclusion that you draw is on you, not me. So let's get it. So we talked about a lot of stuff last night on Triple Threat. And we actually started answering questions out of the comment section. And one of our viewers put the question that a lot of people say on YouTube. And guess what? Me and Music 101 have the dialogue about it. Did Lil Dirt snitch or do we believe that he's snitching anyway? Hey, let this be a lesson. Sometimes you got to have your mind on and be realistic. But let's get into the clip. Shout out to Chicago for this because Chicago is the reason why I'm just drained with this whole snitch thing because they have watered it down so much to make it fit their narratives with different people to the point at this point, probably... <laughs> who knows what's what no more like i just don't even know why do everybody say is dirk a rat like why why is that let's start there. Let's start there. <laughs> like why <laughs> is that always mentioned like what yeah again y'all had to hype me up to pull dirt background and to find out he only got two convictions is crazy the way y'all go on and on why is that always a narrative like what has where what paperwork has he been in or what case has he been a part of to make y'all say that? Like that be I really want to know. That's really a, a question for the viewers. Like, where is that coming from? Now I can understand people that that envies him or maybe be a little jealous of him because he, you know, started from point A and now he at point Z and other people may not be there. So I understand them throwing it out there, especially if they're a rat themselves, you know what I'm saying? But right. us as a viewer, like viewers outside looking in, what makes y'all say that? I don't know. I think it's because of that case though, with, with, you know what I'm saying? But that like, has been cleared. And and I understand that, and you know, say I'm not saying here a rap, but when that case happened and it was clear, I was confused. Like, you know, what I'm saying even you got people that's in the streets is still confused because how now now what street ninja will be confused on that? Like, even breaking it down, like why would they be confused on that? Because it's not the case within itself. It's the okay. We know for a fact. We know for a fact that it was guns in the car and somebody was shooting, right? We know that for a fact. Whether who it is, okay, no, 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 no. No, because I might say we know that no, no, a flash no, 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 no. came from a car. Right, 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 right. Listen. And someone was shot that okay, had a gun so, himself. So at first it was like, okay, and I'm track, I'm backtracking. At As first, always. at first, they lied. They lied and said they knew that was dirt in the car for sure. But so, are we, why was that confusing when the street people on YouTube and all that always say, well, the police lied. So why, why was nah, that? Nah, because they said it in court. So we was thinking before, before I seen the videotape and all that shit, when they first came out and said, we seen dirt with our eyes. That's what they said in court. So I'm like, if y'all seen dirt with y'all eyes and y'all know a gun, y'all seen him shoot the gun. That is a convicted felon in the possession of a firearm. If he beat the charge of attempted murder or assault, he's still supposed to went down for having been a felon in the possession of that firearm. But then when I seen the video and you can't see who the hell is shooting, then I took oh, my statement back. But see, this is a, the thing too. And yo, it's me. We're not going. He said. How Vaughn was looking at him in the courtroom. But listen, this is my thing, right? <laughs> the officer, wasn't that a Chicago officer that got on the stand and said that? Or was that was, an Atlanta officer? I can't remember. Was that an officer or was that like a um a prosecutor? Oh, the tech, or no, no, it wasn't. It, it was the detective it had to be a, yeah, it was a tech, but I can't remember if it was a Chicago one uh or not. But anyway, so right. They can't just go off of who they think it is when they look at the video. He may ha have actually felt like that was Dirk in that video. 
that's not enough. And I really think, dang, somebody let me know, was it a Chicago detective or a London detective? Because that would, again, I have something to say if it, but anyway, um, but they had witnesses right. that said, mind you, remember, it was females at the truck talking right. to whoever was in that car, in that truck. So, again, witnesses corroborate and then they don't corroborate no more. Okay? The victim in the case stopped corroborating. You know what I'm saying? So, right. Yeah, but, and see, that's what right, through bro, the They do. did say that about him. They said they seen him with their own eyes. Right. Who said they seen them? The witnesses that didn't corroborate no more, right? No, that that detective or police officer on that's a what, video, on right. a video, right. right? That's not that's not enough, okay, to be held by itself. That a detective or a police officer that was not present on the scene but later saw a video. Y'all don't watch the first forty eight. Like, you don't even really need to know the law or anything like that. If you just watch the first 48, they'll tell you all the time. You know how many times the detectives have said, oh, that's such and such. But now we need somebody to tell us that that's that such that and person. such right, on right, there. Right. Now, with a witness saying that's such and such, and then you got a detective that say, hey, I know this such and such because of whatever, whatever. That's one thing. But yeah, I just feel like if the only option, right? Is Dirk is a whatever because of that case y'all reaching and that just shows how everybody says they're wise enough to understand legal and law they they're you're not now if y'all have other cases that's different but if the Atlanta case with King Von Dirk Basil and Hella Bands is your only option or only piece of um rebuttal. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not even about to answer no more questions <laughs> on that. That's the only thing. Okay? Yeah, for we sure. got people like Take a Pawn that literally try to spin a narrative that I told by or change my mind after I told, and y'all sitting here trying to reach with that. That just don't make no sense. Right, facts. I agree. I most definitely agree. But that what that right there, that detective saying what he said, that right there spent the narrative for me at first. Because I'm like, ain't no way if they... Know. If they know that was him and he they dropped Shame all the charges. I feel like now I understand why you always be the one to hit me up when people be swirling around. So I'm like, well, <laughs> you know what because you be the leader of that. Who was not on scene. Now come not okay. Tripping. Not, but listen, but at first, okay, now listen, I took it back. Once I seen the video, I said, you know what I'm saying? Nah. You, you know how long ago lying. that video? Yeah. In between, so you was leading hey, the pack. I honeycomb braids. Hey, I honeycomb braids. At least I came That's back crazy. and said, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe, tell a friend to tell a friend to pull up on your girl, Mickey Truth. And as always, donations are welcome to support the channel. Hit the cash app, Mickey Truth 2022. Holla! Uh, Shout out, Truth. Mickey. Mickey, you gonna be big. Like yeah, I, I love I'm trying to conquer the world. Coming from where I come from. They doubted me, but I came up.